Anthony didn't find me as funny as I did. So, um, we are, that is not a one-handed open pill bottle when you do that. Anyway, so we finally heard from Summit Lending after hearing Friday, or Wednesday, Friday, Monday, Wednesday. We finally heard back late tonight. Here we go. Now I can take my pill. Um, and it was kind of like a denial. It, it was weird because she said the numbers are coming back incorrectly. Like the, what did I say? Something ratio. I don't know about ratio. Oh. Uh, yeah, I told you on the phone. Payment to, anyway, so the money coming in, income to something ratio uh, was, income oh, income to debt ratio was coming up at like 73% and she goes, your ratio is actually only a 40, so things are so something was wrong and I just told her to back off because we went and seen someone local. And they're working with us. Our credit scores have gone up again, which is good. And they're supposed to, she said the projected, as long as we don't, you know, do anything drastic in the next 30 days are due to go up even more and my middle score in 30 days would be a 620 and what did I tell you yours was like a 604 or something all the paperwork's downstairs and so which is good the house may still be there in 30 days I don't know but I got a good vibe and they're going to work it tomorrow and then let us know something, which with the other place, we never got that. It was a hurry up and wait. So, yeah, that's where that is right now. Anthony is making a character. Oh. He's making a, a character. What? Am I making a character? Yeah, you're making a character. Anyway, and so I am exhausted today. I told you don't forget your drink. What'd you do? Left it over there. <laughs> um, oh, I ended up going shopping before the meeting and then after the meeting. And I want to make muffins and put them in the freezer. That way Anthony, myself, or the kids could grab and go. There was some, I'll have to show them the picture, they're peach cobbler ones. Oh, they look good. And then, did I? I didn't even, I couldn't find cranberries. I was going to make a cranberry orange one. Walmart, it's definitely a seasonal fruit. And so, I didn't think to check. I didn't think to check the freezer section. So, I don't want to go back to the store either. They look really good. Mm -hmm. Um, so... Peach and cranberry is a good combo too. Peach and cranberry? Mm -hmm. Oh. I know lime and cranberry you said is a good one. Anyway, so I just want to make up a bunch of muffins. They're a good breakfast, and then I want to do egg bites. So I picked up some bacon uh, sausage today. I have, of course, eggs, spinach, and then I've got a little uh, silicone thing that uh, we'll be able to make them easily, and then I can pop them into a freezer bag 
which is good because then he'll have more food to eat. How is the overnight oatmeal? Looks good. Okay. Did you like the flavor? Yeah, so far it's been blueberry. So the stuff we put in didn't help? Uh, the one that had berry flavor had more berry flavor. Uh, if any of them have had any other flavor, no, nope, blueberry wins. Okay. Flawless victory. <laughs> um, so, yeah. And then I bought more blueberries, but I'll use them for muffins. And, oh, I wanted to get strawberries. I never did. That would be the time to get cherries. Cherries aren't too expensive. They're not this time. Um, no, because remember I bought 10 pounds of bing, which only took the kids and I... 48 hours to eat, or no, 24 hours to eat 10 pounds of cherries and I only spent 10 bucks. It was really good too. So I bought a baking non-stick silicone mold dishwasher. <laughs> Microwave safe. And they're like <clears throat> perfect egg bite size. I have a tickle in my throat. Excuse me. And then I got muffin papers today. It really... Oh, they're also used for muffins. But they're so shallow. Shallow. <coughs> that I don't see that it would be like muffin tops. Cover that shit up. Maybe I need to look at them because these egg bites look really big. And so do the muffins. Easy to clean, hand wash, soap. Food grade silicone. Easy to use, which is nice. I'm gonna put them on, to use it, you simply put it on a cookie sheet, follow the baking instructions, or you can simply push, blah, 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 place them directly on a regular cookie sheet. With our pan, there's no need for sticky cooking spray, messy wrappers. Just pop them in and they're ready to go. Anyway, so there. Um, and so I'm gonna make a bunch of those. And then that'll, you know, be breakfast. And then I see we finally ran out of eggs. Did we? I had three. I made 20. And there were 18 in the thing. I had three. And I made them Sunday. Yeah, I had three. And it's Wednesday. I took two to work and I had one while I was here. See what? Count three. If that's Connor, that's ridiculous. That's the same kid who said that I could have more than five in a city and I'm fine. You're all, you told them they could have more than two. I told them don't have more than three in a city and that's pushing it. I would suggest having two in a, in a go. I don't think you should have two every day. No, I, I don't even have two in a day. When the two that I took, I had the last one today. So I thought it would be, uh, oh, thank you, a good thing to make them, but obviously not. <laughs> because control issues abound. Um. Oh, my hand hurts. Oh, I thought it hurt. No, my hand is cramping. Anyway, so we'll have to keep an eye on that one and decide. Because 20 eggs in three days, four days, three days is ridiculous. And Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, three days. Well, weren't they getting into them Sunday? Uh, only two, so that's why I only said 18. Okay, Google, broadcast. 
What's the message? Kids, come here. Okay, broadcasting now. Anyway, so yeah, um, been doing a lot more meal prep to help out Anthony because once again, uh, I don't feed myself. What? Come here. He's the reason that m middle stuff isn't going away, especially the not eating part of it, because that's going to make it worse. Yeah. Are all the boiled eggs gone? I don't know. I saw the lid in the sink. Uh, possibly. Or sister just put the lid in the sink. Well, so I need... she, she made two into deviled eggs and then stuff for dinner. Oh, she used them for dinner? Yeah, you said she could. Oh. Where are the deviled eggs? She made two of them into deviled eggs, so there was only four. Yeah, she, but... She made two into deviled eggs. That's still 16. No. And then... He's been having eggs. Even... Oh, hi, Pooh. Kitty. My main coon. Come here. Close your eyes. Come here, Blue Mountain Lion Kitty thing. Oh, God. Mm. All 20 pounds almost of you. <laughs> is he... How much does he weigh? 17 pounds. 17 plus pounds. It. What I do is I, like, put him on his side, kind of push him down, and then I... Up, so yeah, Lex tried to tell us today he was five pounds. Was it eight five pounds? Or eight or yeah, what? some weird number that what? isn't possible. No. I think I think just his That's back real. half is more than eight pounds. <laughs> I guess I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Oh, you're falling.